What's going on, guys? I'm back this week with my fantasy football update, recapping you guys on my last week's matchup and my upcoming matchup for this week in week six. And I was two and two going into last week after I explained in the last episode or the last part of this series how I was thrown into a matchup after I was supposed to be on my bye week. It's really confusing. But last week I did get some redemption and got a victory. I scored 117.7. I could have played a little bit better. I would have gotten like five or six more points had I played Tory or uh, had I played Antonio Brown instead of Tory Smith. And I was lucky my opponent played the wrong quarterback last week because if he played Alex Smith, I would have ended up losing here. You can see he played Andy Dalton. It was a good matchup, I thought, against Miami. 17.6, though, put me in a good spot for Drew Brees to throw four touchdowns and get me the victory on Sunday Night Football. And he had other guys step up for him. I mean, Brandon Marshall had over 20 points, and Tony Gonzalez had a big week. But Drew Brees really held my team together as well as Victor Cruz with three touchdown catches. I'm really happy I got him now. I was going to originally draft A.J green instead of him but the pick before me ended up being AJ Green and so I had to sell it for Victor Cruz and he's been uh, a little bit higher scoring this year so it's been good so far and as I look ahead to this week's matchup now you can see I'm already off to a pretty poor start I started Antonio Brown this week over Torrey Smith because I liked his matchup more I mean Torrey Smith against Morris Claiborne Brandon Carr as opposed to Antonio Brown against Jason McCourty and that Tennessee secondary but he only got me 20 yards total and ended up uh, in a loss there with Tennessee getting the victory 26-23. And then I have a pretty good opponent this week. He has Peyton Manning, Arian Foster, who's had a monster week every week. Jamal Charles, Des Bryant, Jeremy Curley, and Heath Miller already is 6.7. Packers defense, I'm not sure I'd start them this week against the Texans. And then Lawrence Tynes, but I'm mostly worried about Arian Foster and how much he does tonight on Sunday Night Football. But also, Peyton Manning is a good matchup against that San Diego secondary, and Jamal Charles can always bust off a long touchdown run. So hopefully these teams get held in check, and my team comes with a victory. But I have a pretty good opponent this week, but I like my matchup. My team is always pretty good. I believe I'm still the number one scoring team in the league, and so I'm pretty confident this week, as always. But the main difference for me this week is having to start Andrew Luck over Drew Brees, because it is Drew Brees bye week, the week I've been dreading this whole season. But I have Andrew Luck. He's been good this year, but he's on the road against the New York Jets so we'll see how he does I'm also entering Doug Martin back into the starting lineup against the Kansas City Chiefs and so anyways guys that is my matchup this week in fantasy football if you enjoyed the video please do leave a like and a comment let me know you want to see more of these videos every week but thank you guys for watching I'll see you guys next time